What's going on everyone? Thank you for joining me on another video of Pastime with Mike. Today I have a collector booster box of Strixhaven School of Mages. Um, pretty excited to open this. Actually I've been playing online quite a bit and um, the variations in these cards that I've seen from other um, people opening them up on their YouTube channels and whatnot, they're phenomenal. They're gorgeous looking cards. And the foil versions, the non-foil versions, you've got your showcase versions. I think you have your, um, your um, what is it, Jap Japanese variants. It's just a cool set altogether. Fun to play. Definitely a fun set to play. A little more complicated than I'm used to. I'm not, uh, you know, um, I'm not that weathered as far as a Magic player is concerned. I have um, a little bit of experience, but not too much. I would definitely say I'm sort of novice when it comes to playing the game. But anyway, I, I always appreciate the art on the cards, and uh, I am a collector. So most of this will end up in my um, PC, and some of it will head back to a store or uh, elsewhere to uh, find some find another home. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into it. I have opened this product off, off screen just to get kind of a feel for what's in it. Um... I still do not know exactly which which ones are the Japanese variants. Um, I could appreciate the art for sure, but I couldn't tell you offhand. I do know for for sure one specific card because it's blatantly obvious what the card is. That being the Demonic Tutor, and of course that's the one that's worth I think the most amount. I'll put this off here and we'll get into it now. We got an inkling there as far as our token we've got heated debate make your mark spiteful squad essence infusion cogwork archivist master symmetrist rip apart we've got fractal summoning crackle with powers our first mythic rare We've got Lost Shield Clockwork Scholar, Verdant Mastery, we've got Duress, and right out of the gate we have a Mythic Rare, I think, in the Chinese version, and I do not know what that is, but that's some sort of wizard or mage holding up the sun or something. That's cool. Okay, we've got a second one again don't know what it is but this is the foil variant and then behind it we have another mythic rare oh wow and it's the foil version that's cool look at that awesome and i don't have sleeves in front of me do i let me see i'm gonna reach into the camera for a second and i don't have sleeves in there actually you know what I think I might put at least a foil variant in a sleeve. That's cool. It's a little different than the orange that we're used to as far as the Mythic Rares, but cool. All right, second pack. I wish I knew guys for you uh, <laughs> to tell you what the cards were, but yeah. I got Biomathematician, Combat Professor, Study Break, Campus Guide, you've got Scurried Colony, Divide by Zero, Creative Outburst, Illuminate History, Dramatic Finale, Oversimplify, Manifestation Sage, Whirlwind Denial, and then for our Japanese Japanese alternate art, put this guy over here. We've got Whirlwind Denial in the foil, and right behind it we have a a summary judgment in the foil. That's cool. We'll put that guy up here, and don't pay no attention to my piles. I'm just trying to keep them in a sort of some sort of order. Let me get these guys over here, and we had. That can go there, that can go there, that can go there. Rare, rare. Put 
this here. You might be able to see that. I'm not sure. And these guys are all common and uncommon. So let's just leave these off to the side. All right, pack three. So far, so good. Get uh, two Mythic Rares and the Japanese alternate art. And uh, you're doing pretty good, I guess. Not quite sure what the cards are or the value even. But uh, first day of class. Stonebound Mentor, Barag Befuddler, Beaming Defiance, Charge Through, Igneous Inspiration, Silver Coil Apprentice, Necrotic Fumes, oh no, well there goes that, alright, we have Elemental Expressionist, where do we we have Angel of Ruins. That's a cool looking card. A Plurag Dean of Chaos. Where are we putting this? <laughs> Jeez. So many variants. Um, and we have our Japanese alternate art there. Put this here. We have Weather the Storm. And then we have another Japanese alternate art in foil this here and then in the back we have exponential growth and there's so many variations it's, it's kind of hard to build piles you do have to have like 15 piles <laughs> and this is pack three wait no pack four pack four yeah okay we've got dragon's approach vortex runner star pupil professor's warning lower hold campus Tenured Ink Caster, Golden Ratio, Pest Summoning, and then we have our first rare, which is Spellbinder. We have Dika Fractal Theorist, Blade Historian, our alternate art, Japanese version. Put this over here. We've got Tezzeret's Gambit. And then we have Village Rights. Oh wait, there's a card behind it. Orik Lore Mage. Cool looking card. Put that up there. Alright, moving along. Fifth pack, almost halfway through. This set is super cool, man. I uh, I enjoy this very much. Like I said earlier, and these cards are freaking phenomenal. The art on these is just out of this world. Elemental Masterpiece. I don't know if this is a sign of things to come. Or this is just like a one-off sort of deal that they did for Strixhaven. But, man. Uh, Serpentine Curve. Silver Quill Pledge Mage. Crushing Disappointment. Archway Commons. Secret Rendezvous. Devouring Tendrils. Start from Scratch. Our first rare is Alchemist. Accomplished Alchemist. We've got Inferno Project. Multiple Choice. We have a Japanese alternate art here. We've got Doom Blade. We've got another alternate art, Japanese in the foil. Put that there. And then we've got Weather the Storm foil. Put that there. Awesome. All right, pack six of 12. And we still only have two Mythic Rare. No, wait, four Mythic Rares. I guess the count is what the count is. One, two, three, four. Cool. Not bad, not bad. Uh, let's go. Twin Scroll Shaman. Infused with Vitality. Arcane Subtraction. Mage Duel. Needlethorn Drake. Mascot Interception. Maelstorm. Maelstrom Muse. Expanded Anatomy. Our rare is the Silver Quill Silencer. Then we've got Curiosity Crafter. We've got an Elite Spellbinder. Japanese Alternate Art. Beautiful. We've got Lightning Helix. We've got the Thrill of Possibility in a foil. And we've got Putrefy in the foil. Look at that. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Put that down there. 
All right, halfway. Six packs to go. Let's go. Let's see what else we can get in here. I like the dragons. I'm a big dragon fan, so if I can get one or two of the dragons, that'd be awesome. Oh, start over. Ageless Guardian, Illustrious Historian, Square Up, Bayou Groff, Novice dis Dissector, Go Blank, Read the Pests, or Tend, tend the Pests, Inkling Summoning, then we have Valen, Dean of Vain, I think there's a flip side, yep, flip side is Lislet, Dean of the Root, put this here. Replication Technique. Oh, look at that. Myla, Crafty Companion. I think this is a flip card. And then Luca, Wayward Bonder. That's a cool card. That's another Mythic. Put that in the Mythic pile. We got Divine Gambit. Behind that, we have our Japanese alternate art. Don't know what that is. Does look like it's a rare, though. Um, we have Revitalize, and then we have another rare, and again, not sure, but pretty, pretty art. I like the colors on it, that's for sure. And an Elemental. All right. Mythic Count, I think, is at five now, which is very good. It's pr probably um, on par with what's normal for the boxes. Lorehold Pledge Mage. Pillar Drop Warden, Resculpt, Reckless Amplimancer, I guess. Crushing Disappointment, Kelpie Guide, Lower Hold Apprentice, Introduction to Annihilation. Let's see, we got uh, Pestilent Cauldron, Incarnation Technique, Hall of Oracles, Claim the Fire Firstborn. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. That's cool. Um, our Japanese alternate art. Another rare. We've got Opt. Foil. And then in the back there we have Shale. Dean of Radiance. That's a good looking card. Nice art on that. All right. So four packs to go. I'm not even sure. I usually keep a count of Mythic Rares because that's where the that's where the value is for the cards. Um, however, in this set, I honestly think that it's in the Japanese alternate art slot, and and of course a little bit in the Mythic Rares slot. But the Japanese alternates are the ones that are, I guess, fetching the highest prices at this point. Uh, Cram Session, Curate, Prismari Pledge Mage, Tangle Trap, Promising Dusk Mage. Snow Day, Deadly Brew, Environmental Sciences. We've got Poet's Quill, Scholarship Sponsor. <laughs> oh, okay, look at that. We got our a Mythic Rare Dragon. We got Belodros, Belodros, Witherbloom. That's cool. Cultivate. Another alternate art in the rare. It's a good looking card. And then we have a foil Japanese alternate art. I think that's actually a cultivate, if I'm not mistaken. Off the top of my head, I think that might actually be. And then we have Vine Glimmer Snarl. Vine Glimmer. All right, three packs to go. A Demonic Tutor would be nice. And any other card that's uh, of value. <laughs> Let's see. Moldering Karak. Sudden Breakthrough. Rise of Extus. Campus Guide. Spring Main Servin. Show of Confidence. Aether Helix. Spirit Summoning. And we've got Strixhaven Stadium. Ryan. Reiner Pret. I don't think I said that right, but I'm not even going to try it again. Strixhaven Stadium. The alternate art. That, that looks like a gremlin or something. That's, cre that's creepy looking. Look at that. That's awesome. Um, let's go over here. We've got Chaos Warp. 
think that's an alternate art. Yeah, put that over there. And then we've got a gato or a cat in a purple dress. It looks like that's awesome. <laughs> and that's the foil variant. Put that here. And then in the back there we have Ingenious Mastery. All right, two packs to go now. And we just picked up our sixth Mythic Rare, if I'm not mistaken. All right, Blood Researcher, cool card to play with, definitely. Frost Trickster, one of the more drafted cards in the set, I'm guessing. Witherbloom Pledge Mage, Novice Dissector, Prismari Campus, Bookworm, Academic Dispute, and then we have Basic Conjuration, the Bioplex, Radiant Performer, we got the Sedgemore Witch, Opt, I uh, don't know what that is, Japanese Alternate Art though, another Japanese Alternate Art Foil, like that. I like the celestial look in that one. And then we've got a Sedgemore Witch and Foiled in the back. All right, last pack. Let's get some last pack magic in this place. Oh. All right. Enthusiastic study. Augury Battle Seer. Not going to try that again. <laughs> Got Reject. Letter of Acceptance. Spined Karak. Stonebinders Familiar. Reflective Golem. And then we've got Teachings of Archaics. Culling Ritual. We've got uh, Triplicate Titan. Baleful Mastery. Another cat, this time the non-foil version. We've got a Faithless Looting. We've got a Negate in the foil. And final, finally, Lightning Bolt in foil. Cool looking card. Awesome. That's all I have for you guys today. Um, most likely next video will be a Watch Gang video. Um, I do have it. It's in the, it's at the, you know, what is it? It's in the mailbox, I think, today. So if I pick that up today, I'll most likely make a video for you guys tomorrow and have it before the end of the month. And we'll hope for that. Cross our fingers. I am working this week. Um, I appreciate you guys stopping by. Like and subscribe. Uh, I know the community that I have with the Magic the Gathering is not very big. I'd like to grow it. For sure, I do open, um, a f uh, you know, not, not a considerable amount by any means. But I do open some product in Magic, and I en enjoy it very much. So... Again, like and subscribe. Thanks, guys, for stopping by. Past time with Mike. I will see you on the next one. Thank you. Bye.